Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryda Matsuro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Crazy Boss V31, Wee's GNZ Gaming, Mori Superman YT, Foxy, and even DNT. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I really do appreciate their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go and check them out. And we're going to get straight into the video. Now this video is all about on how to install the replace HUD and blip colors mod inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below. So let's get straight into it. Now this mod is pretty simple, pretty easy. So all you got to do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open file location. Next, make sure that you do have a scripts folder, and make sure that you do spell scripts correct, and make sure it is all lowercase. Open up your scripts folder, then go to your extract folder, then go to this folder, then go to this folder. Then now all you got to do is select all the files and then now paste it inside your scripts folder. Then exit out of your extract folder. Now before we do get into the game, I just wanted to let you know that inside your replace character.ini file, you can double click and now you can change the colors for Franklin, Trevor or Michael. So you can change the colors to whatever you want, okay? So all you gotta do now is save your colors, then go to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click, refresh your game folder, exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I'll see you guys in the game. And now we are in the game, so my game is frozen, but don't worry because I've got enable all interiors inside my file but um yeah so as you guys can see that there is uh like color on my mini map over there on my left hand side so when you open up your map you can see that the icons has changed for franklin and it will change uh for trevor and even for michael so um yeah so as you guys can see the icons has changed and even when you bring up your gun the weapon wheel is changed as well for the colors and when you want to go and change to another character uh, as you can see the status is the stats is basically changed as well so you can change to a different character and then the different character will be a different color so as you guys can see it is working 100% works you can change the color inside the INI file as well. So I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. And we're back again, so I hope you guys do enjoy that mod. That mod is an awesome small mod, but just to let you guys know that you can change the color when you go into your scripts folder and you go into your INI file and now you can change the color inside here for Franklin, Trevor or Michael, okay? But I left it as default because I cannot be bothered doing it, okay? But you can change the colors, okay? It's 100% real. So with that said, okay, if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Or if you do get stuck installing any other mods, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that as well. My Discord server is inside my description below, so go and check that out and make sure that you do select the PC modding support server. 
So with that said, if you guys did enjoy this video, or if this video was helpful, then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I will see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace. And I'm out.